everyone, Xantok here with Select Star Gaming, and welcome back to more Pokemon Alpha Sapphire. Alright, well, time has come. We've got a job to do. So, Ava, fly us back to Slateport City. Because we've got a submarine to save. Ah, uh, let's go! Where's the submarine, though? I actually don't know where it's at. Oh, this is the museum, so not here. Is it over here? Wait, maybe. I don't think so. No, this is where they're working on something, though. Wait, I actually don't remember. I don't think it wasn't here. Fuck, I actually don't... See, this is what's gonna happen. We we get we got distracted, we did side quests, and when we finally came to go do the thing, we got lost. We don't know where the submarine is. Not here. Maybe it was that building we just came out of. I think that was the shipyard. Wow, I'm being so bad right now. Oh, there should be like a back entrance there, that would have been cool. Hey guy, uh have pirates come in to steal your submarine? Okay. Hey, Mr. Briney, read the joyous and this knowledge and expertise. The help of a legendary sailor means the fairy plans are really coming together. Oh, wait, no, they're making a fairy here. This isn't where the submarine is. This is, this is a boat. Not a submarine. We're gonna get there just in time for it to, like, sail off and we'll be like, ah, shit. Hurry! Ride our acrobike! Faster, faster! It must be up here. Found it. Yes, indeed, and that is why we intend to move ahead with our expedition. That's wonderful, Captain Stern. Thank you for taking the time for your busy schedule to talk to us. We hope we can interview you again with news of more discoveries. Was that Gabby and Ty? Probably. Oh, that was my first time being filmed for TV. What a nerve-wracking experience. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's so traumatizing, guy. Listen, your submarine's about to get stolen. What? Yeah, listen. Oh, it's you again. You're looking well. Glad to see you. We made a huge discovery on our latest expedition to the seafloor. Wait, what did you say about my submarine being stolen? Nah, that's crazy. Anyways, we found an underwater cavern on Route 128. And we think it may be the den of a super ancient Pokemon. Long thought to have been extinct. Wait, that's the alarm. Ah, testing, testing. One, two, three. Okay. I hope you're listening up there, Captain Stern. We of Team Aqua will now be assuming control of your lovely submarine. I tried to warn you. You'll contribute to our great plan by returning everything to the beginning. I hope you appreciate this great honor. Um. Do you hear that voice? It's like somebody's using a megaphone. Or just, just really, really loud. Who is it coming from? From your PA system? No, it came from the harbor. Our submarine, they took it. Young man, I'm sorry, but please come with me. I mean... I came here to try and stop them. Oh, those thugs. They're the same law you tried to take the Devon parts at the museum. Impossible! You actually followed us all the way from Mount Pyre! You got me! I bow to your persistence and love of justice! It's a pity. So it is. But we're well past the time when you and your best efforts could turn the tide. We'll add a few last touches to this submarine, and we'll be all set to bust open the sea floor cavern. Where that great Pokemon is sleeping, our plans to return everything to the beginning. They're as good as complete. But I know you gotta do what you gotta do, scamp. I'm not going to tell you to quit chasing us. Go ahead, then. Follow us all the way to our hideout in Lily Cove. 
if that's what your honor demands. I've actually already been there. Now then, Shelly. Got it. You guys, keep that spoiled brat busy until the submarine takes off. Let's go, Archie. Got it. We'll see you there, scamp. My little scampy adversary. Bye, submarine. We, um, we tried. We should have done less side quests and gotten not gotten lost. I can fight like Poseidon even on land. Okay. Seems kind of like a weird thing to brag about, but sure. Alright, so Intimidate because our attack, but unfortunately for him, it doesn't work on us because we got special attacks. Remember that guy said that he could fight like Poseidon on land? I guess Poseidon's not very good at fighting on land. Hmm. Shame. P Poseidon is not so good at battles on land. Yeah, I figured that out. What a pathetic man. I'm the 26th, the strongest team Aqua Grunt. Leave this to me. Well, at least we got two Pokemon. Let's see. Carvana, and I'm gonna guess... Grimer. Whatever it is, it won't be very good. Just shout at them. Tell it bad fish. Oh, gold that right. I feel like we've gone up against these two before. One of them just had a mighty in it, and yeah, this was that Mount Pyre. And then the second person had a uh, Carvana and then a gold bat. All right. It must be the same two trainers, I guess. And yet they haven't gotten any better. Yikes. Mission complete. I'm gonna check out the modified sub in our hideout. I'm psyched to see all the modding in the sub. You're gonna mod the sub? Why? M modding? Those criminals! What are they planning to do with my submarine Explorer 1? That's what you named it? Oh, they can't be. They can't be after the super ancient Pokemon that slumbers at the bottom of the sea. Santok, I'm sorry, but my stolen submarine, it could bring an unimaginable disaster upon the world. Someone has to go to their hideout in Lily Cove and stop them. But I've got no chance alone. Santok, please, may I ask for your help? I can at least get you as far as Lily Cove, where their hideout is. Do you think you and your Pokemon can put a stop to them and save myself from being used for evil? Please. Okay. Thank you. We'll launch it once. Do you have a submarine explorer too? I guess so. We've arrived in Lily Cove City. Those thieves who stole my submarine must be hiding out somewhere in this city. Santa, please find my sub for me. I'll be heading back to the shipyard in Slate Park. Start dealing with the aftermath of all this and leave you to do the dirty work. Bye bye Cool. So hey, we're back in Lily Cove. We weren't gone for very long. Uh, let's go ahead and heal up, though. We really don't need to, but we might as well. I was kind of hoping to uh, swap out our bikes for back to get back to the mock bike, but I guess we'll do it after we finish this little bit of plot. Uh, do we want to rearrange anything? Yes, we'll put Belle at the front. Oh my god, Belle's the only one not at level 54. If we can get her to level 54 before anybody hits level 55, that would be fun and, and awesome. And I'm so down to see it. Ah, uh, those Team Aqua... Oh, they're not all gone. Never mind. I lied. But we can go up here now. Yeah, there was somebody that was stopping us from going up here before. But we couldn't do that. 
Hey, what do you have to say now? Uh, the same thing as always. She just wants to have her parents be happy, I guess. Those people probably say the same things. I wonder if that guy at the Wilmer is still there. Yeah, he is. Unfortunately, he's not stopping us from going to their base. Bye, guy. Welcome to Team Aqua Hideout. If you are playing Omega Ruby, this place has the exact same layout, it just has a different aesthetic to it. And oh boy, I get to play the teleporter game. Nugget. Tastes like chicken. Too bad you can't ride your bike here. Get, play this, get through this place faster. But hey. Wow. Took you long enough to see me. Ay ay ay! Suspicious character spotted! Yes, I'm so suspicious. I'm the suspicious one out of the two of us. I'm the one that looks like a half-baked pirate and stole a submarine. Right. Alright, Belle, you know what to do here. Just copy their stench and then blast them with blast of psychic energy. Perfect. Carvana. All right, we can deal with a fairy type move. Actually, no, we'll use. No, yeah, we'll use fairy type move. We're gonna save magical leaf form. It's just a water type, and that I wouldn't want to use a different move for, which would pretty much just be. Actually, do they use any Pokemon that are just that aren't that are water but not water dark? Does Team Aqua have any of those? I'm not sure if they do. At least I haven't seen any to my recollection. Oh, we got some stairs over there. Do I want to do the stairs? Or I think I want to do the teleporter first. All right, go back. Goodbye. Great job, Bell. Damn it, Zach to level 55. Oh, you're so close, Bell. You are almost fully caught up. But there's gonna be a little bit left that you have to do. Taking a break is important, isn't it? Team Aqua doesn't have, to, have, doesn't have fixed working hours, nor specific break time, so if you wanted, we could take a break all day long. I wouldn't tell your boss that. Wow, there's actually a lot of people in here. Full restore. Guess this is their break room slash dormitory. Expanding the sea. What exactly do we have to do to achieve that? I guess we have to keep squirting water, right? <laughs> I don't think that's how that works. Each person's bed reveals a little something of their character. And it reveals a unique odor signature as well. So, do you only have eight grunts that work here, or do you double up? What's the deal? I'm guessing they double up. Okay, before we fight them. Oh, jeez, which is actually the correct way to go? Don't know. Oh, well, not this way. Escape room. Escape. I'm not slacking off. I'm facing a very difficult decision. <sighs> what drink to take with me on my 12-hour lookout shift? Fresh water, soda pop, lemonade. Uh, I think I'd go with lemonade. <laughs> These guys are bad. Meteorites, natural energy, super ancient Pokemon. Here, we're conducting experiments to understand how they all relate and create a blue orb artificially. But we haven't had much success. It may be too difficult for humans to solve. Can you... I mean, you already have the real blue one, so... I don't know why you need to have a fake one. Also, looks like you failed. 
We've got two teleporters here. This guy is definitely going to battle me. Yep, there he is. Do a supply check. Something else check. All slots is get rid of everyone who stands in our way. Ah. Uh, about that. Quick feet, we got those quick feet. I don't know, man. Hmm, gold bat. Hmm, I think we can take care of that easily enough. Psychic. Hey, they were level 54. And Zack was the only one that hit level 55 before we could get there. We're pretty, pretty close to catch guns. I mean, we might as well be already. I don't know which teleport to choose first, so let's just do this one! Uh, this feels plot relevant. So let's go back. Hey, you! No, no, no! Uh, this is Team Aqua's library, where documents on our highly confidential plan are stored. No outsiders are allowed to enter. That's a shame. Thanks for the max elixir, though. This guy did a real bad job of stopping me of going into their library. I don't know what he really thought would happen. I am ten years old. Does he think I listen to the adults? Please. Well, it's a Wilmer pail. That's fun. It's also somebody's bedroom. We got some magazines. Can I sleep in their bed? No. Okay. Is this all that's in here? Or is there not anything fun? No items? Wilmer doll. Okay, not a Wilmer pail. Picture of a boy with a shaved head, a girl with black hair, and a Pokemon with three nails attached to its head. What? The seventh day of the blank month, 002, with Archie and something Rachi? Wait a minute. No? The letters at the edge of the picture are faded and hard to read. I don't know what that's referring to. Huh. Okay. Thought there'd be something in here. The only other thing I can think of that fits that other blank is Jirachi. But, I don't know. It seems odd. A Pokemon with three notes on its head? Does Jirachi have notes on its head? I don't... Mm, I don't know. This seems weird. I think there's supposed to be something in here, because it's, it's saying that there is. But I couldn't find any item in here. I thought there's supposed to be uh, like a TM in here, but I don't see it. I'm kind of confused. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'm being lied to. It happens. I have to check on things there. Whatever we're, we're, we're in a battle, I'll take a look, see what I can find out. There you go, we're a scientist. We also got. Oh, hello. God, there's so many teleporters in here. Maybe this is the room I was thinking of. Ugh, give me walking with the hideout bores me. So I'll take you on. Team Aqua Grunt, two Pokemon, it's a Carvana, and then it's probably gonna be a Golbat. Because that's what they have here. 
Alright, we got some rough skin. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. Uh, so let's go ahead and do Disarming Voice. Oh, Grimer, okay. Sure. I think I figured out what I was missing. I don't know what, I shouldn't have done that, I should have done Psychic. Is that actually, well, it would have hurt us if we were a lower level. Yeah, I made you lose. What about it? Okay, so I think that teleporter takes us to the uh, the next room. Or the next place to go, actually. The Aqua Suit is the fruit of the collaboration of Devons in our science and technology. If not for Shelly, who used to work for Devon, the invention would never have materialized. Can I have it? Nope. Okay. Nest ball. All right. Go over here. Oh, hello. What's this? Machine for testing the durability of the suit. Touch panels are crammed on the screen. Give it a walloping. Throw a lot of weight on it. Ring it tightly. Drop it from really high up. Burn it severely. Submerge it intensely. Thrash it hard. Lead it massively. Jesus, alright. I'm gonna calm down a little bit. Wait, is this the place to go? Oh, no, okay. Just an item. I definitely recognize this room, though. From a previous place, I was like, wait a minute, I'm confused. I didn't think we were going here yet. And we aren't. Do you want to see if I can go through the store? No. Okay. Danger! Please don't play inside. It's super dangerous. Really, I mean it. If something bad happens because you didn't believe me, don't blame me. That's what's written on our note, tacked to the wall. I still can't go through the door. Big sad. Let's try the other teleporter. I don't know why they have these little hallways. Like, just teleport me directly to where I'm going, please. Okay, this is the room I was thinking of. It's an old radio. A cassette tape labeled Bro Special. Volume 7 is inside. TM97. Dark Pulse. Great dark back move. Love it. That's, that's what the room I thought that other room was. Because it was said it was supposed to be like somebody's bedroom. I was like, well, this looks like a bedroom. Apparently, it was the wrong bedroom. I guess that was Matt's room. The other room was Shelly's room, I'm gonna guess. Oh, God, there's so many teleporters. Uh... What? Let's do the left one first. Oh, Jesus. I'm so confused. What is this? Okay, we made it through, apparently. Or we didn't. Fuck. I have no idea what's going on. Alright. That was useless. All right, well, I guess this area is kind of dumb. I don't understand what we're doing here. Don't. What? Okay, I don't think I'm supposed to go there yet anyways. I want to go here first. War panels! The hideout's pride and joy! You're clueless about where you are, aren't you? Bluster and tire out the enemy and then lower the boom! That's our plan. Alright, a mighty Anna.
And disarming voice. Actually, I think it was supposed to go through there first. Shit. Hang on a minute. See if I can look at this. Okay, so it says first we do left, then the middle, then the right, and then the right? Well, that don't make any sense. I feel like I've been lied to. Uh, or did I miss something? I'm confused. Um. What the hell is this puzzle? Seriously. This is so stupid. See, I can get here, but then I don't know where I do from here. Like, what's, what do I do? Okay, I get back here, and I go left. God damn it. Holy! All right, we got a lot of items in here. So this is actually Archie's room. He has a tiny bed. Ah. Electro. Cool. At least we're soundproof, so we can't be affected by their shit. It's funny, because we stole soundproof from them. Psychic! Are these the strongest enemies we've fought in a long time? It might actually be. I think these are our first level 40 enemies we've faced. A fucking Master Ball. Hell yeah. And the Nugget! And the last one is gonna be... Another Electrode. More psychic. More, I say. Need a bar hitting fifty five. All right, now we can go back to where that other grant and that teleporter was. Uh, I think we can just go from what up. Wait, no, I'm dumb. There we go. Get the fuck out of this room. I hate it. Sir? Ha ha! You really kept me waiting! How about a battle with me? I can do that. Carvana, we know what to do with that. Starming voice. And yeah, they definitely customized the the submarine there, made it look like a Sharpedo. We finally meet again. Hmm? Oh, is this the first time we've met? Nincom poop, doesn't matter. Brace yourself, we'll show you the power of Queen Tuplets. So we've had horde battles with wild Pokemon before. However, this is cool. We have a team 
of Aqua Grunts sending out a horde of Poochie in us. Uh, I think this is the only time in the game where you have this, which is kind of unfortunate because this is a really cool concept. I love this a lot. It makes perfect sense for an evil team to cheat. Like, why send just one or two trainers at me when they can send out five at once? It's awesome. Unfortunately for them, they're dead. Still love that they did that. That's really cool. It's one of my favorite things that they did with this remake. Oh no, you got us. I did. We lost. It's odd. I can't believe five of us couldn't defeat just one trainer. Did you cheat? Ninkum poop. Stop whining. Our leaders are ahead. You have no choice to defeat them. Or no chance, rather. I mean, I feel like you guys are the ones that cheated. Hey, an item. Oh, fuck. No, 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 no. I want the item. Oh, I knew you'd come. Yeah, don't worry. I'll, I'll get there. Give me a second. Max revive. Nice. You're the first punk ever to sneak into this hideout and make it this far. I expect nothing less from a crumb like you. But I've got some bad news for you. We already finished, we already completely finished upgrading the ship in no time at all. Look at that drill. As long as we've got that thing, we can KO the seal over the seafloor cavern with one punch. My bro Archie's in the ship. Come at me. You gotta take me out fast. You might better catch up to him. Before you do, though, we just settle once and for all who's stronger. You and your sorry Pokemon, or me and my not-so-sorry Pokemon. Ho! Ha! I'm heating up. Full on, I'm burning up. Me, you, Pokemon, mixing it up, dueling, stalling for time so Archie can leave. Well, 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 let's battle it out until we've got nothing left. So one thing that's weird, that's a little bit weird to me about this. So it makes perfect sense that Team Aqua, you know, they're trying to get a Pokemon under the sea and using a submarine to get there. However, in Omega Ruby, also this guy, again, only has one Pokemon, uh, they also steal a submarine and they take it underwater to get a different ancient Pokemon. And I'm pretty sure they make their submarine, oh, why did I use Psychic? God damn it. They make their submarine look like uh, Camerupt, which makes no sense. It's like, what the fuck? All right, whatever. Like, it almost feels like these the uh, Generation 3 games are more fit for Team Aqua to be the aggressors than for Team Magma. Because while team, it makes sense for Team Magma to go to the volcano, the main bit where the story primarily is, is the ocean. And you know you're going underwater, they steal a submarine. I just feel like Team Aqua makes more sense as the real threat. I wonder if that's how things originally were, and they decided, hey, for the second version, let's change it to a fire team. I don't know. Maybe someday somebody should ask. Unfortunately, though, we were too slow. We were too late to stop the submarine. Oh, which means Team Aqua is again ahead of us. Ah, oh, well, we were battling it out. My bro Archie finished getting ready. I have only one hope. For my bro Archie has finished doing what he set out to do. Well, that's all. My bro Archie is everything to me. I live to serve my bro. All right then. You took me out, so I'll give you an idea of what the world will be like if my bro has his way. My bro Archie is headed for the big blue sea that stretches out from Lily Cove City. Deep beneath the surface is the seafloor cavern. That's where the world my bro hopes to create. The beginnings of the primordial world will be felt. Regular people and Pokemon can't make it there, though. How could you get there? Why don't you look around in town for the sea and use your own thick head to think about it? You mean like Lily Cove? Where we're at? Hmm. Alright, so that's all to do here in the hideout. Uh, at this point, we just need to get back to Lily Cove, but then we'll... We have to wait a little bit before we can get back to the plot. But we will be doing some surfing along the next route. And we'll be doing that in the next episode. So I will see you all then. Bye, everyone.